It's very long ago. Ah. It all makes sense. A bush boy, because he came from the bush. Morning, my loves. It has been maybe two days or so that I've actually picked up the camera. I've just been resting in the hotel, you know, time of the month came and I just literally chilled in the hotel and relaxed my body. But today we're on the move again. It's 6.55 a.m. and we're on the way to Onicha. We're trying to avoid traffic, which is why we're leaving this early. I've already shown you the view on the way there. But maybe I'll show you some more again today. Let's enjoy the next few days in Onicha. Eric hasn't said happy Valentine's Day to me today. He hasn't bought me a gift. He hasn't kissed me. He hasn't done any of that. So I'm waiting for my love. Happy Valentine's to you guys. Hope you're having a good day or had a good day because this will be in the past by the time you see. And you've got to spend time with the one you love and just make it memorable. My battery is dying. Have I got a spare one? Don't know. <laughs> These people aren't even moving. Are they paying police at the top or what? Yeah, I think they are paying people. They are paying for a military in France. That's the, that's the, that's the. That's what's causing the yeah, hold up. So every vehicle will pay. That's right. How much should they pay? I don't know. <laughs> Depends on what's uh, What they're carrying? Yeah, what they're carrying. Jeez. And they're not even checking them, they just collect them. No, they put them there them. to check them. But, but they're, they're just. Available first. Yeah. But my husband is the bush boy. Yeah. Me too. Pardon? I'm not bush. We've reached Onicha and we're hotel hunting. We just looked at Nicola. Nicola. We didn't like it. It was a nice. It was a nice. But this is a nice area. We we'll hope to find some food. This place is it's always fine, but it's expensive. Yes. Yeah. Zero two. Yeah. 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 See if I can go. Which of you? Come on, I want every woman and every one of them. Look at this boy. He won't wait for it to cool down. No, you're quite a job. Eaten and we're full. I need to sleep. Yeah. Even just have a nap for like uh, one hour. Yeah, I feel good. Valentine Bay. <laughs> this is the first time I've seen my husband drive on. Hey, woo. Your first time. Not Eric driving. Mm -hmm. 
Those are the first time they say you need to drive. Let's see if you can drive. Should I should I double double strap myself? I should put the air back on. Ah, cover myself with the blood of Jesus. So. Hey, okay. <laughs> Oh, Surprised my camera doesn't steam up. The heat. I need to take my hair out today. If I can wash it, it'll be better. Okay, steady driver. Steady driver. Is Eric a better driver than me? There's no way. There's no way. What? I cannot drive in this country. And the narrow roads is going down. Street. I wouldn't be doing that. So probably. Okay, we're on a visit. The palace of the Oba Obi King of Onitia. Oba in our language. Well, this is how my husband parks. Sit the line. He's over the line. I'm better parking than he is. Look where we are. The famous surprise. So here there's just bare different shops, electronics, furniture, perfume, cosmetics. Where did you find my earrings? You already forgot. Wait a day, you're gonna like this killing me. I'm just running too much armpit. Are you taking pictures? No. Take up some water, chin chin, wipers, coat. These are fantastic. I'm going to do my hair tomorrow. There's some all day tea. Of course, I always need the water. Yeah. And these are just to try out. We're back to the hotel. There was traffic. I don't know why. Hey, so we're back in the hotel. I'm about to take my hair out because I'm doing my hair tomorrow. Yeah, I think I'm going to do a separate video for that. Oh, I didn't tell you what ShopRite was like. ShopRite was long. The queue was long. It was a bit of a hype. But we got what we needed. It's almost eight probably be an early night for me catch you tomorrow for this day i want you for fun out yeah it's that yeah move way is it long it's not mm. that long though it's very long ago ah it start to see people with this long natural hair around them. Mm. Mm -hmm. So they charge extra. Maybe I don't know. I'll go and start pricing now. <laughs> okay. But you don't hot comb it now. No. Why? I just don't put heat on my hair a lot. Okay. They're washing his car for him. Mm. That's normal. That's the way they do it. Really? In hotels? Hmm. Mm. Only that now. Maybe I'll. Let me just check what that's because he's saying. Okay. So I'll be sure. Though I'll be coming back with the mechanic here. Oh, okay. But I want to be sure that it's a fault. Okay. Good morning, my beauts. Good morning. It's another beautiful day in Onicha. <laughs> I almost said Lagos, I almost said Anambra. Girl has really been traveling around Nigeria, but yes, yeah, so we are in Onitsha. This is day two here. As I mentioned last night, I'm doing my hair today, so I took it out yesterday. I don't have any of my wash stuff, and I didn't bring it because when I asked my husband, he said they would wash it before I do it. Um, when I asked my other sister Vivian, she said they will wash it before, but this. The sister, Juliet, that's actually taking me to the hairdresser said, No, nah, they're not washing it. <laughs> so they're not washing it. So 
I'm not sure how long I'll keep the hair in for because I haven't even told you guys but my new wash day routine is to wash my hair every week because my hair needs it and I've noticed it's been growing since doing that weekly wash routine so <laughs> I don't know how my hair's gonna react with to the fact that it hasn't been washed I, I washed it two days before i got here so it is dual wash and i was really hoping i would get it washed before putting the braids in but alas we go with the hand we're dealt with it is currently 7 36 a.m i got about 6 40 today i don't feel as tired as yesterday but i still could do with some sleep today i have a full fit on long sleeve and trousers because my sis said that the salon can be cold and I've still got extra in my bag because I hate the cold I do not like the cold I left London cold for a reason okay I don't want to come here and be cold I've got a full fit the only thing that isn't really warm warm like that is well I say warm warm is because it's a belly top but this black bando but it is cotton so hopefully it will keep my chest warm last night Eric went to buy me food we went together and we went to this joint called Nibbles it's just literally five minutes down the road and as we were going I saw some soya I've been asking him for about soya so he bought me some soya as well really enjoyed the soya uh, the jollof rice not so much anytime they put Anytime they put carrots in the jollof rice, just know that they're just doing midi midi, like they're just doing rubbish. I'm not gonna make one. I'm not gonna See you later. You gonna pee? All right, later. Okay. So it's got fault, Tabby. Hmm? It's got fault, Tabby. I, I I'm not very sure, but let him start the car first. But I've got the mechanic, you come and check it. Okay. Bye. Uh, oh. Sorry, love you too. Oh yeah, let's go. Bye bye. Bye. Thank you for picking me. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> the breakfast wasn't ready, so I didn't eat. Why? The breakfast wasn't ready. Huh. Okay, don't worry, I'll go buy you something. Maybe later. Maybe. I'll buy you jollof rice somewhere. Oh, well, when you're hungry, let me know. Okay. I'll go there. Ah, these people are there. Hold up. Mm. Are you going with your camera? Yes. I'm going to record the whole thing. Huh? I'm going to record the whole thing. How do they make your hair? Yeah. <laughs> Nigeria style. <laughs> it's two lanes. These people have come uh -huh. and made it three somehow. They don't want to join the lane. They don't want to join uh -huh. the actual lane. Mm. So they've made their own lane. Right in the they are still entering here, but yeah. they just want to be fast. Small time they will start begging you, please, now let me join the name. <laughs> Outside by the roadside. By the roadside. Wow, baby, how are you? Bye, thank you. Looking sweet. Thank you. My husband is here now. He decided to copy me. He's wearing black and white too. I finished found my the, hair. Found out that the car is not having any issues. Oh, it was me that was panicking. <laughs> oh yeah, did I show you what happened yesterday, or did I say what happened yesterday about the car? The car was overheating, and Eric was checking it out, and he thought it was because the fan wasn't working. So he was panicking, tried to use water to cool it down, all this kind of stuff. So today he got his sister to get an electrici electrician and a mechanic and there was nothing wrong with the car. Eric was just panicking because he's not used to cars overheating. But because of the weather, they said it's normal here, basically. But he spent, what's the time now? It's like three. Two. He spent the whole morning trying to sort out this car issue. At least now he knows. We are. I finished my hair. As you can see, really nice, love it. And 
I did my toenails as well because the polish they used in London just wasn't conducive to this trip and my feet were looking busted but <laughs> obviously it's not a proper nail salon so I had my feet on his leg it was very uncomfortable but he got the job done it's really nice he was offering me colors I would never wear like green gold mm -mm, I'm not that kind of auntie <laughs> that's not my kind of color so I went with the pink the safest bet and now my feet look cute again we are going to the palace we are going to the king's palace this is not where he lives mom told me this is not no equi told me this is not where he lives this is just where they do ceremonies what kind of ceremonies do they do here this is where he um entertain his kids his guests um yeah this is just guests and um, events okay yeah i think i Pleasing. I want to say to you lot that the real vlogging begins today but why is it still making that noise that's what made you panic is the noise and it's still making it this is beautiful it's gorgeous it's beautiful it's gorgeous it's amazing it's all of that I really should come and take some pictures here, but I need to do my makeup. This has been here for centuries. Hundreds of years. Eric is doing tour guide for us today, guys. Wish us luck because sometimes Eric says things and might not mean what he's saying. Oh, so what's this? You're not sure. I know. It's okay. I like these steps. It's so pretty. King of Onitra. Obi of Onitra. I think we should come like when it's open. But when is it open? Let me see. I'm entertaining people. Oh! Yeah, like, uh, you dance. Oh. Yeah. So the king and the the high chief. Yeah. We do where you dance. It's got a library too. Imme. What more? Obi library. Imme Obi. The arm for people of furniture. Okay. These are all the kings from the past. The first king. The founder of furniture. The first king? Yeah, I'm the founder of furniture. Name's 15, coming up. 1500, 1580. Okay, what's his name? Ezra Chima. Yeah, these kings and they took over now. Oh. And he didn't have this many children. It's like a very family in the UK. Yeah, like King Charles, Prince yeah, William. Yeah, like that. The, the, the so the, the, the descendants, exactly. Yeah. Bush boy. Guys, I call my husband Bush boy all the time. Show my love. What about this one in the middle? King Okosi, the first. From 1900. 1900? Yeah. 1931. King Okosi the first. But they have two, another one took over. So why is his bigger? Why is who is is he special? Uh, yeah, yeah. Obi, Obi, Obi. Oh, okay. oh yeah, Obi is king. Yeah. So after this one was this one. So it's going in chronological order. So of course. Mm-hmm. The first. So this one, it's 1931. So this one took over 1935. Okay. To 19. Oh, this was his son. They look alike. No. 
Joseph Okudili. Okudili. Yeah, this you met him. No, this one. You met him. Yeah. In your dream? No. Is that your, is that your mom? Yeah. You met him in person where? Yeah, in the palace. Hey. Hey. No. Um, in his house. Somewhere. Somewhere. Yeah. Why were you invited to the palace? No. Um. The wife. The second wife was mom's friend. Oh. So. Mm. Enjoyment. That it was that uh, we usually go there on Christmas Day, you know, it's a tradition. Yeah. On Christmas you go to like friends, family, so yeah. They give you money, you know, stuff like that. So we usually That's all you know, money head. <laughs> so they give you we went there and um we met him. This is Eric now when he's bigger, Uncle. Yes, thirty. It's gonna be this empty space is for the current king. And then once that space is done they'll start again from the beginning i mean in front they'll start again in front of them which areas are restricted then this is who someone's family this is um this um this is um a king yeah in the front basically Can I show That was a nice quick tour of the palace. They should actually have like tour guides and dates where people can come and hear all the glorious history but <laughs> tourism and Nigeria <laughs> they don't really go hand in hand like that like that but it would be a good idea to have. Anyway Eric was our tour guide today and he gave us the lowdown so hope you lot enjoyed. So is this a school or something down there? Is that where your primary school is? No. So this is a stadium, I think so, yeah. It's just so they play football here? Huh? It's dedicated to... Uh, the, 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 the. Okay. I don't want to video the school kids. Yeah, I don't think they have laws for that here in Nigeria. Well, that's still just... Respect other people's privacy. We're back in shop, right? The girl who did my hair was asking what cream I use, so... Healthy Hair Studio by Eniton is definitely working well. <laughs> Luckily, I had brought it with me, so... I just gave her the two I had, which was the Mighty Moisture and the Moisture Hold. At least I know if I come back, what the people them need, they need hair stuff. Because to be honest, we came here yesterday, I was looking for shampoo. And they only sell Cantu products here. I might speak to any and ask her about getting her products shipped and delivered in Anambra State because clearly the people don't need it over here. Huh? If they can afford it in Lagos, why can't they afford it in Anambra? Did you not say you guys are rich? Hmm? You rich people. Let's see. <laughs> 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 Imagine 
imagine wanting to pay and there's problems with the bike. Only in Nigeria. Only in Nigeria. <laughs> Don't come to Nigeria at this time. You're wasting your time. You're wasting your time. Bank transfer not working. Cash, there's none. Card machine hardly ever works. So, just standing around waiting for payments to be confirmed. Then, you get debited twice. Then when they say that they're going to refund one, it will take 7 to 90 working days. Imagine. Not even 90, 95. 7 to 95 working days. So, it's a lot happening. My pizza. This is a beef, ground beef, sweet corn, chili, pizza thing. Eric, jollof, Chinese, fried rice, turkey, fish, palm fried rice. Oh, no, 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 no. Julia is going to eat some of the pizza. <laughs> To my friends and click when I call them, I'm all pulling up. Walking in the street, yeah. I don't understand. They're giving them the body love, they can never hear me. Oh. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eric is reminiscing because this is where he grew up. But he's saying everything has changed. <laughs> Do you even recognize anyone there? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I get down there. Yeah. Someone recognized him. Someone recognized him. You recognize him now? Something. So, yeah. So it, so it is. Move your dusty leg. So we are back in the hotel. I bought ice cream. Now every time I've gone to buy ice cream, the ice cream is always melted because the freezer isn't freezing. Or they come and tell me that they've just put the ice cream in, which is why it's melted. I bought ice cream. It was frozen, but we've been out all day. Hey, babe, sleeping. Babe, look at what you did. This is an ice cream. At this point, I don't even know what to say. This looks like mousse to me. Do you want some? When I went to get my jollof, I saw straw. And I thought, you know what? I never will be able to use the... Use the straw for the ice cream because it's going to have melted by the time we get to the hotel. And I'm correct. <laughs> Take. Huh? It's just foam. It's just foam? Yeah. Is it not your ice cream now? Is this not your country? Welcome to Nigeria. So you don't want to? No, I'm gonna eat meat pie. Eat meat pie? Yeah. Is this boy not bush like this? That's your audience. Meat pie and ice cream. I should ask my audience meat pie and ice cream. Yeah. I'm not asking them that. Because I'm the only one that's allowed to call you bush. It's, it's not like you want them to insult you. So that I went to see the village Eric grew up. It all makes sense. Now bush boy, because he came from the bush. Mm. Hey, man, look at my face. <laughs> wow. How's it seeing your friends again? Yeah. I'm so happy seeing, seeing all of them. Speak here. Oh yeah. Oh. I'm so happy seeing them now. Yeah. No one, no one recognized me. <laughs> Just <What>? one person. <laughs> My shoulder. Now Eric is driving. He's not complaining about his shoulder. He's complaining about his back. He's complaining he's tired. I just, I just want to put this Pain. in. I just want to put this in the vlog because when I'm driving in London, it's like I haven't done anything, right? So, I'm glad he's driving. I, I'm still yet to even drive him to the ground. Because at times, sometimes I would have driven all day. 
he'll still not be saying, oh yeah, so where are we going to next? I'm like, you and who? Who's driving? As if driving is, driving is not easy. Whether automatic or manual, it's not easy. Nothing is tiring, fam. So now it's Eric's turn, now that he can drive her and I can be in the passenger seat, I'm gonna make sure he faces the kind of things I face in London when I'm driving. Sometimes he doesn't, he doesn't pity me, so me too, I'm not gonna pity him. I have a zero pity. Only thing I should say now is get up and go and shower. I don't know why you is not on Netflix here. Anyway, it's been a really long day. That's what I have to say. I think I'm just gonna Netflix, eat, <laughs> read my Bible and go to bed. Tomorrow, actually, I'm chilling in the hotel for most of the day. Well, I say most of the day, for the morning. I'll meet up with those Oakley's later. But yeah. Oh, the wi is actually working today. Really? You sure? I don't know. Check. The girls that did my hair were so lovely. Was so sweet. What else is it that you said you're gonna show me? Me. Yeah. Cool. You show me the palace. Anything else? A huge. It's not working. Got a cable. No. It's not working. The palace. Anything else? Um. Really, this trip was just about Eric and his family. It's not a quote-unquote fun trip there's been fun parts but it's not really about like being outside basically it's not like a dirty december kind of situation i'm gonna see if i can find something to watch the internet in this hotel trash i think i'm gonna do a compare the hotels thing but the thing is each hotel we stayed in are in different states this one is anambra the first one was lagos and the other one was... Is Asaba and Ambra state? Uh-uh. Okay. Where is it? Which state is it? Delta. And Asaba is Delta. So it's kind of hard comparing because it's in three different locations. But I guess I can compare based on rates, maybe. Because each hotel does breakfast. And they're all really similar in terms of really and truly each room is for one person. Any additional guest has to be like your significant other, unless stated otherwise. Like in Golden Tulip, they didn't state that, but the first, this hotel, the first one we stayed in, had to be like man and wife. And it kind of shows like it's just for one person because when you go down for breakfast, they always say the second person has to pay. So based on that, I think it's still fair for me to be able to compare each of the hotels because they go by the same principles. But I'll just compare like based on price, I guess. Yeah. So like this room is, how much is this room? 22,500 per night. The one in Lagos was 18,000 per night. And the one in Asaba, it's 50,000 per night, but we got it discounted. I'm not gonna act like we paid 50,000, we didn't. Anyway, <laughs> the heat has made my camera swell. The material of my camera. I am going to watch YouTube because I can't watch Netflix because the internet is trash. And I'll probably see you guys tomorrow. Or maybe I'll show you my food that I'm gonna eat before I go to bed. But I'm probably not gonna speak, so. Adios for me for today. Love ya. So I can't, I don't even think I can really do a Lagos snack because everything is imported, right? Like this isn't a Lagos thing. I mean a Nigerian thing, sorry. Have you called your sister? How is she feeling? Okay. Just like a wafer. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 Mom, where did you go that you dressed up? I'm gonna fly now. Hey. 
Realistically, I think wearing makeup is a bad idea. Not gonna lie. When are you going? <laughs> Next week. No. Next yeah. week. Yes, you go down it again before going. Are we? 